Welcome back. It is a new day. Did some driving yesterday. Today we're going to see if we can knock out the engine bay on this thing. I'm about to prime it and then later on this afternoon hopefully put some silver down and some designs and then probably the first coat of clear. Um, I still got to finish masking all the big stuff. Like the fuse box and that right there. But in the meantime I'm just going to can prime everything to get a nice layer on all of it. been just a little bit got all of the engine bay in primer um next gonna let this flash off for just a couple hours and then hopefully later on this afternoon come through with the silver and the blue and start working on all of that i want to try to throw a little bit of designs into the strut towers and the tops and play with the silver and blue contrast um kind of like the opposite of what shirt start interested i think it looks really sweet also gonna try and just see if I can, these were a little rusty, so I just scuffed them up, primed them, I'm gonna see if I can just paint them black and bring them back a little bit. Um, but for now, I'll put this down and pick it back up later when the primer is dry. All right, the primer has set up nicely, went ahead and threw the whole car in a quick bag. Now I'm gonna come through with the coarse silver, get that laid and then grab a little bit of black and do just a little bit of black accents here and on the tops of the strut towers. So afterwards, when I come through the candy, it just gives a little bit of contrast. Let's go mix up some paint and get cracking. base down didn't go too heavy just wanted to get a nice cover coat on just went for the coarsest silver that I could find with a bunch of pearl in it to uh, hopefully make the candy pop I'll give it about five minutes then hit it with one more and then I'm going to mix up some silver flake and some clear and top coat it with that let it dry then come back through and do all of my blue candy graphics all right finished up with the second coat of silver and then came through with a quick coat of black just did a little bit of accents that'll make the candy pop just a little bit more. Um, I wanna try and do the tops of everything in the blue and maybe try sneak some flames in these guys. Uh, but for the meantime, I've got some flake mixed up. I'm gonna go ahead and get on here and then two coats of clear. So hopefully this week I can go ahead and get candy down on it. Just finished up with flake and clear. 
I'm not sure how crazy the camera will pick it up, but it is pretty wild. So our next order of business will be to let this dry and then hopefully tomorrow, if not tomorrow, definitely this week, sand that back down and do candy over top and then clear it one more time. And then the engine bay will be ready to receive the engine. Still gonna find a front mount, uh, front mount oil front sump oil pan and an M50 manifold for this before I can drop it in. Um, but getting closer, getting closer, definitely a nice, Definitely a nice change to see the engine bay with all the rust gone and actually painted. I'm excited to get this thing going, man. It's going to be sweet. For now, I'll put this down, pick it back up when I do the candy, and we'll see. All right, it is the next day. I'm gonna go ahead and get all of this sanded down and then break out the candy and do a couple designs and get some blue down on it. flames cut out now I'm just gonna come back through with the eight uh, eighth inch thin line and just do a line around all of the big tape to make sure nothing bleeds and then we should be ready for some candy all right we got the flames taped up and back taped now I'm going to make a little bit of candy and then go ahead and start getting down on all of this candy is done Took a little bit of the old blue uh, from the old color and whipped it into a nice little candy. Really set off on all the black spots nicely. A little bit of marbling in the back. Snuck some little flames in. So now I just mixed up a little bit of clear. We'll go ahead and drown it in some clear and then call it a day. Just finished up the last two coats of clear. Came out unreal. Very happy with all the little detail I did. Some marbling back there, tops of the strut towers, the little flames, the big flames, and the blue and silver flake really play off each other super nice. I'm real happy with how it came out. In any regard, that'll be the end of this video. Got a bunch done. Did a little bit of driving, but this is a huge step as to getting this done. Now I can work back to front, get the car all built, pop the engine in, and then We'll be ready to go party. For now, thank you guys all for watching, and we'll see you same time next week.